Yes guys, what's going on people? JSTV back again and I'm here at the Brighton Seafront and the weather here is lovely today like you know what I mean so it's fantastic and I'm so glad I'm here but the real reason I'm here today is because Newcastle United is playing Brighton at the Amex Stadium today kick off at 5.30 and this is a game we really need to win because we come here on the back of two straight defeats between one of the two best teams in the Prem, Man City and Liverpool. And you know what? I got it about eight o'clock last night. I was so shattered, so I just didn't want to do a night one. So here I am. So we're hours away from the game at the Amex. Like I said, I'm at the seafront. And yeah, I mean, do you know what it is, right? I mean, I think Eddie needs to um, get his team formation right, if I'm honest with you, because the last two games, it's been quite the same. But I'd love to see Lewis Hall come in if Sven Botman doesn't make it. So if he doesn't make it, switch Dan Burns to centre back alongside Fabian and Shah and then play Lewis Hall at left back. The midfield, I'll keep it the same. I know people are saying, oh, Bruno needs the rest, Bruno needs the rest. No, he don't. He needs to be in that team alongside Joe and also to Nali. And up front, it's going to be able to be the front three. I'd love to see Andy Gordon stay where he is. He's like up front and we're going to have to persevere with me and I'm not slating him because, listen, at the end of the day, you've got to keep on going, got to keep on going because it's work yet and it's in dear that as well. Brighton, um, so far, having a fantastic season so far. Yes, they lost last week against West Ham. Um, listen, at the end of the day, they score and goals. They got the most shots to the Premier League. They're one of the best press ads as well in the league as well. The Serbia's doing a wonderful, wonderful job at the Amex as well. They've got some um, Ansu Fati for goodness sake. This guy is an absolute baller. Big up to Brian De Serbi for getting this guy through the door on the season long loan. And we could have done with him ourselves. But listen, at the end of the day, he chose Brighton and you got to deal with it as well. But at the end of the day, they've got some cracking players that Ivan Ferguson is a player that I really, really like. Danny Welbeck, he's not going to be playing a day. And listen, Lewis Duncan at the back, fantastic as well. And do you know what? They've got some really good players. Pascal Gross as well. And Cecil cannot play a day's out on term injury. And Mitoma, I love this player to death, I really do. This guy is going to be a baller. I can't see him being at Brighton. Um, next season, there'll be loads of clubs after this guy as well. Do you know what? If he's available, we should be over, we should be like him or after him like a like a shot because you know why? We want quality players at St James's Park. The Toma fits that bill. If you're going to win the game today, we are going to get him close down today because I tell you what, he could hurt any team, any back from the Premier League. Kevin Trippier needs to be on the ball today, and I really think he'll do that today. I really do. So guys, tell us what you think. What are your thoughts today? Give us a score prediction. I'm going to say goals in it a day. I'm going to say 3-2 to Newcastle. Actually goals in this. And it gives us a score prediction. Leave a comment section down below. Give us your prediction. Make sure you like and subscribe to my channel. Also, Super Chat's open. And if you'd like to become a member, it's just 9 to 9p. And like I said, like and subscribe. And as always, I win the mags. And I'll see you in the next one.